Hello, and welcome back to a new video. Today I'm gonna tell you about graduating. So, as you can see, I'm kind of dressed up today. Why? Because today is the day I'm gonna get my diploma thing <laughs> and finally officially be done with school, which is pretty damn great. I'm very happy school's finally done for me. I did like the social bits of it, but for example, like all the classes that I didn't want to take, especially in the beginning of high school, because after three years you could choose a package of uh, courses you wanted to take, but before that you had to take everything. So I had to take German, which I hated, because I was very bad at it, because like, why Germans? Why do you have so many words for one thing? And why are you so similar to Dutch, but still so different? Like, it confused me a lot. What were my favorite courses? I think drama, which is theater. Um, I liked geology and geography thingies, like earth sciences. That's a helicopter. I also liked English because I'm pretty good at it. It wasn't really that difficult. And things I didn't like were, for example, math. Like, don't think that's a big surprise. Spanish, even though I am going to continue doing Spanish. I didn't particularly like it because I'm very bad at grammar. Uh, a third course that I didn't like, Dutch. Same thing, a lot of grammar, and if it wasn't grammar it was spelling, and I do that right unconsciously, but with that you need to write down all the rules, you need to write down everything you can. Like why do you use this word, and why do you need a D or a T, or... I could do it all, like without any mistakes, because I've read a lot of books, but... I couldn't write down the rules for it. Oh, and my worst, worst course, and I didn't even include it because it didn't go the last year, even though I did have to, um, it turned out to be a little bit of a problem, was PE, like gym classes, sportsy things. <gasps> I don't particularly hate sports, I hate sports in school, because you're forced to do things you might not even like. We were supposed to run for like 15 minutes, and I have this exercise asthma thing that makes me unable to run for long or I feel like I'm choking. So I didn't like PE at all. I, I hated it so much that I banned it from my memory and which is why I forgot it. <laughs> um, yeah. Next thing I think would be, do I have something from school still? Uh, I think I do. I think I have quite a lot of it actually. I'm gonna get some stuff and then I'm coming back so I'm gonna Stop the recording for a bit, bye. Right, so this is my oldest diary, and in this is something very nice. Those are all my pictures throughout the years of how I changed through high school. Like, look at my teeny tiny baby face there. I was so damn cute. So, this is what I looked like when I was 13, like 2009, and this is how I changed throughout the years. And you can see that there is where my fa emo phase started and it's, that's from the beginning of this school year, like September. So I just wanted to show that in the first place, because it's fun. In this diary is a lot of things. I even wrote stories about how I got to school after summer break and get a boyfriend and get, finally be happy and all things like that. Like, that was cute. <laughs> that was really cute. This is a list I made. It's of my first class and all the red people are my friends, or at least people I like to wanted to be friend with. The top one is me, like double A in my surname, I'm always on the top. There's things next to it. I even like marked my crush. <laughs> it's really cute, that was my first high school, no, it wasn't my first high school crush, but it was my biggest. Like, this diary starts with that crush. This starts from my second year in high school. This is my class photo of this year, and that's me, that one. Then I'll show you the first class photo and then I am there. I'm so tiny there. I used to copy it and like put all the names on it. I should make a proper diary video. Right, so I just went through my memory box and everything and just got a few things. Got a few? Got a few things. First of all the oldest things that are these. We made them at arts and crafts kind of thingies and this is a clip, clippy thing in the shape of an elephant. And this is a box in which I now keep my calligraphy pen and my ink. Then I have uh, this. <laughs> it's a thing I made right before I became emo and I think that's quite obvious. 
and it's a thing um, every year there is a week in which you do all kinds of cultural things and this was a workshop we could do which was uh, graffiti and spray paint thingies and you could make a mold and this is what I made it's on a wall somewhere another thing from the uh, cultural week thing is this uh, I have an entire keychain full of like little keychain things <laughs> and one of them is this and this I made these myself, also in a little workshop thing. And then I have the most fun thing, which is old agendas, diaries, planner things. Not sure how you would want to call them, but I don't mind. So the first one is from 2012-2013. So this is the front. I designed this one myself. That's a thing you can do here. And it was fun. These are a few pictures in there, both me, uh, both old with all my contact info. On every page I'd make a little illustration thing. Ooh, birthdays. I'll just quickly show the pictures and the bigger event things. I, I, I designed it all like Minecrafty and all. To put in my grades here and I never did. <laughs> Most of these are very sassy. Like comments don't say anything. As in bad comments. We, we have different words for that in Dutch. Fruity. Oh God, I even marked my first kiss in there. Apparently it was on the 30th of August in 2012. That is so cute. I didn't even know I wrote that in here. Oh look, it's a space, space page. Oh, look at that, it's cute. I'm very sorry for being so loud, but it's cute. I had so many tests and things. This is a picture from when I was chosen for a writing contest thing and I could go to the finals of that. I didn't win anything unfortunately, but I was in the top 10, I think, of my age group. And this is a picture of me and my best friend in a little courtyard thing there. Why did I put in socks? I'm confused. They're not even pretty. I have a moustache and you don't. I don't have a moustache, thank you. I'd prefer to not have a moustache. I've always been a weird kid. There's a little song in here that me and my then best friend used to sing all the time. And it's a Winnie the Pooh song. That's what we used to sing everywhere. And we made coconuts out of everything. Like we, we used to put like three dots on everything. So we had a coconut wall, a coconut table, a coconut diary thing, planner, a, a coconut bag even. We had coconut everything. Like if you put three dots on it, it was coconut. Nice picture I made. Yep. E emo, emo face started. Oh, this is me and my mum at the same kind of writing contest thing. Oh, kittens! These are two kittens. Like, we used to take care of uh, foster kittens, and these are two of them. And she had a broken front paw, and it was so sad. My first relationship is in here as well. Like, every Thursday, I think, it's like, together with him for this and many weeks. This is the back. It says, super cool agenda thing. Uh, Hands off, my agenda is super cool, never eat an elephant. And then on the side, like, Rocket, the name of this font. And then lastly, I hope I can still go through this before the time runs out. The front, this is 2013-2014. And what I did was every page had illustrations. Every one. And then not just one thing, like this. I did this all myself. And that's why this one is pretty cool. Every, every one of them has a different pattern thing on it and it's really cool like lovey-dovey things from my first relationship like it's really really pretty cool like every every page has a different kind of thing on it and I did that all myself and there's a lot of it Ooh, what kind of grades did I get sevens except for science which I got fives which is not good. How many pages did I do? I did, did a lot of them. Like, oh. Eventually I stopped doing it because every page took me about an hour. Yeah, this is the 50th page. So that's 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57 pages. Every single one of these 57 pages is filled with a pattern. Damn it, that is a lot. The back I even started, but I never finished. When I forgot my notebooks. Where I met my second boyfriend, that's also in here. 
birthdays of people I don't even remember. And all kinds of nice patterns. I think that's about as much of babbling about school that you might be able to handle. So all I'm gonna say now is good luck to you if you still go to school. I hope you have a nice time. I made some of the best friends I have in high school. Um, so I'd say just venture out and try to be social and make friends. I know how hard it is because I was pretty socially awkward as well. I still am. I'm kind of weird. Yeah, I never really learned how to be normal. And that's kind of cool, I think. Because I like not being normal. Anyway. <laughs> I'm rambling. I'm rambling a lot. I will see you next time. Thank you for watching and I hope to see you again. Bye! I love my hair today. It's like, yes. I'm so out of focus now. I'm in focus now, but then you can see that my brows are not on point. Oops. Focus on me.